welcome to our show. Tonight is Trashy Corner. I'm a fag. And I'm a hag. Thanks for joining us again and sticking through to this second installment of our show. We've got a new nice new studio and hope it uh, helps with the quality. So Trashy Corner is basically going to be our opinions as a thug and a hag on current events, celebrity news, and some political news that might be important to our As it current. pertains to us. That's right. And our opinion on it. So tonight, okay, I have a few topics here I kind of want to cover. Alright. You heard anything about Simon Monjack, who is Brittany Murphy's late husband, I yeah, guess you'd say? Yeah, he died just a little bit ago. They both died, I guess, from the, pretty much the exact same cause, which is, they don't know what it is, pneumonia or the mold or whatever. It's a little fishy to me. We got moldy bread. Moldy fish. Moldy fish. Something about mold was mentioned, um, but the mother said that they never came and tested her house, so she says that as far as she's aware, she, there was no mold. The but house is fine. That's what she says, or they haven't been tested. So anyway, the news with him is that apparently he went and blew through Brittany Murphy's entire pension from her. When she was doing acting jobs when she was younger, they make you get a pension. So I think it's part of the Jackie Coogan law or something to protect young actors and actresses from their parents. I wonder how much it was, um, though. I don't know. It probably couldn't be very much if he was able to blow through. I don't know. He probably could have gone through millions yeah. of dollars in days if he was doing right. the kind of drugs that it seems like they were doing. Right, right. And it looked like they were doing. But, yeah, <laughs> um, yeah thousands of dollars from what I understand was like hundreds of the accountants saw little, uh, or not little withdrawals, but large, huge, like hundreds of thousands of dollars at a time withdrawals from her pension. That's crazy. In Monjack's name, and that's, you know, that was her next of kin, so that's who they're going to go to. I don't yeah, know. I'd, I'd like to see that. Uh, house now that it's been redecorated or has well, all this new stuff or where that money went. Out, the mother still yeah. lives there. What? Yes. Did she get some of that money? I don't know. I bet she that's what you, That's what the whole thing is, is that is there any money even left after he blew through it all. Wow. So. Speaking of drugs, now Michael Jackson's uh, doctors, there were eight of them I guess in total. Seven of them are not going to receive any charges. The one that um, we've all heard about uh, will actually be charged with crimes committed I can't for even actually get killing Michael a Jackson. Doctor, <laughs> let alone eight doctors to look at, you know, inject me full propofil and yeah. night. I mean, who uses propofil to get to sleep? I mean, wow. you must have some really bad, bad, bad insomnia or drug addiction to be needing that not to get to sleep every night. That's ridiculous. So, Pretty but, crazy, though. I guess Conrad Murray has been allowed to, that's the one that actually that's administered doctor, his fatal, that killed him. fatal dose, yeah. Um, he is, I guess, still allowed to practice medicine. That's insane. I Anybody just think that whole thing was a bad deal. Anybody who to somebody outside of a hospital should never have their license. That's true, and I agree with you there, but I think at the same time, like, that was, that could have happened to any doctor, you know? I mean, who's going to say no to Michael Jackson? I mean, really. He could have. He could have. He could have said no, but let somebody else do it. Yeah, well, that's what's him, done. Is, is done, and he's, you know, he's. I don't know. Then you make a mistake like that, and it should cost you your medical license. For sure. But For sure. What's done is done. So. Yeah. So Hulk Hogan, Hulk <laughs> Hogan, and Linda Hogan. She's marrying some fetus. He's like 21 years old, friend of her son. I yeah, guess, went to high school met. with her son. Yeah. And now they're getting married, and Hulk Hogan has apparently approved and so um, confirmed the rumor that they are engaged and going to be getting married. Mm. And he says he's happy for them because they're cut from the same cloth or something, and it's just, it's, I think Weird. it's wrong. And I, we haven't heard from Brooke yet about it, though. But I oh, know I'm sure she's not happy about she's it. She's gone public about saying it was gross, disgusting, and nasty. <laughs> well, it is. It is nasty. <laughs> he's like, okay, that's like dating your son, I'm sorry. Yeah. He's dating your son. No matter how you look at it, that's gross. Yeah, she's a pedophile. Yeah, definitely. Okay. So, Lindsay Lohan.
Oh, so much there to talk about. She has completed her first week in jail. And apparently her sentence went from 92 day, or 90 days to 22 days and now to maybe a little over two weeks. But they're expecting her to even get out By this the next weekend. By the 1st of August yeah. is the new supposed release date because of overcrowding and you name it. And yeah. Her time served. Yes, yeah. <laughs> Two days she was in there the first her time. Her celebrity status. <laughs> yeah, and I, oh, get this, get this, I love this, okay. I'm not a nasty bitch, but I do enjoy when somebody who gets, finally gets their comeuppance, really, yes. who really deserves it. Well, I guess she was getting heckled in the county jail by the Is other... Is it for having her hair extensions in, in No, jail? but I guess she cried when they took them out. <laughs> ooh, ooh, they're taking out my polyester no, hair. hair I had before. Give back my couch. <laughs> So, yeah. Um, and where are my drums? <laughs> <laughs> Only at five. Oh, Lindsay Smurf. <laughs> so, they were heckling her hardcore because I they're too. all the. She deserves it. Well, all the um, prisoners' whole day it has to be planned around her. And oh, when okay. she's going to go for meals, and they have to listen to her fucking whining and crying. Well, that's not surprising. She did and, that the last time I got it. You know, Phantom years. snorting her coke. <laughs> <laughs> throughout the whole thing she and, must be missing it. and so they started to heckle her and you know what they said they were chanting fire crotch fire crotch fire crotch <laughs> I would too <laughs> which I'm sorry it's it's childish but it's hilarious and you deserve it Lindsay this is what, what else happens can you expect from this is what happens yeah. you know that you're with their schedule and they're one hour outside <laughs> you know so I thought that was pretty hilarious, so she had to put, be put in solitary because of that. So I'm not going to devote any more time to this little trog. Yeah, trash. 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 Just like our corner, because that's what we're talking. Okay.